life I barely spoken Your words have been so broken I've been under your hypnosis Why did I sip that potion? I'm so done with holy ghosting My birth Hey guys, welcome back to the channel And today, it's finally here The Black Marlin Ready to Run is here And as you can tell, I am very, very excited about this Before we unbox this Let's get into the specs. So, it's got a, it's like the impressive speed of, I'm just reading this straight from the paragraphs, it's like generated by, it's like a 3500 kV motor in combination with a 20 amp water cooled ESC with reverse included, and the included 3S 1800 milliamp LiPo battery pack. And then it comes with a stand already. And then it comes with stainless steel trim tabs to, Improve control and quote unquote turn on a dime. And then you can pause the video right now and read this if you want to, but I'm not going to. And then those are the specs if you want to pause it and read those. Otherwise, I'm done waiting. Let's crack it open. Check my scissors. There they are. I've been awaiting this all weekend. Tab up here. You might have to raise you guys up some more. Hold on. It's high enough. All right, guys. Oh. Just I will get you guys adjusted soon. Just trying to. I gotta do a jank setup here because my old tripod broke. So. That's a little bit better. Alright, so I'm yep that. And it should just open up. Oh, there's one down there, but rip it. I'm gonna have to cut it. Oh, dang it. Oh, God. Well, if you didn't notice, I already hate the sound of styrofoam, so here we go. Like, I hate the sound of styrofoam with a passion. I'm all the way back here. Alright. So I got the box out. So, flip it over. So here's the uh, manual, which I am going to read later. And it's got this uh, 2.4 gigahertz um, radio with um, first tech FHSS technology, you can read this if you want. But it's a Rage Radio. This is a nice radio. Doesn't feel cheap. It's got steering trim. It's a pretty basic radio, but yeah. I like it. Not bad. And you got your uh, wall charger to get you started. And then... Four double A's get you going. That's a true RTR when they include all that. The frequency balance charger. I'm not gonna use this, I'm gonna use my hobby grade charger. And then, where is it? Right here, this is the included 1800 milliamp LiPo. And I got big hands, but wait, it's not that big. I got LiPo packs that are way bigger than this, so I think I should be able to get 30 mile an hour speed with the same runtime, but. I'm gonna put this on my balance charger right away and get it balanced because it's probably been sitting for a while. And then just some spare tools with a bind plug and some double sided tape in case you need to remount the ESC. And then the stand. I got the black trim one, which, lucky me, because some of them were just like not good looking ones. So, put this together. So then once we get the boat out, and just set it on it. This is a pretty good stand. I like it. And now here's the cool part. <laughs> so, uh, this thing is huge. The camera does not put this into perspective. 
that also matte finish. <laughs> this thing is so, this thing is stupid light. So let me bring you over. So it's like got stainless steel hardware on the back, stainless steel fins, stainless steel tabs. You can adjust these. Propeller. I've heard some reviews where there was broken stuff out of the box, but this one looks fine. We have all the running hardware in back. So uh, this is where it takes in the water right here through this tube down there, and that shoots it out oh, right there. Otherwise. Less screwing around, I guess. This thing is so sick. It's like, oh my gosh, I can't get over this. And uh, yep, just lifts up. And it's a little bit over straight from factory, but that means I actually painted this, so that's pretty neat. Okay, so then there's some. There's styrofoam up here for added buoyancy. Or is that just. Yeah, that's meant to be there. So it's got a. Oh, this is way smaller than I thought it would be, but. It's a 20 amp water cooled ESC. So the water comes in. Oh, I don't like how it's bending right there. I have to. Yep. So then it goes from back here all the way to here. And then it comes, goes through, comes out here, and goes through the motor. And, um, yeah. Otherwise, Dean's plugs, which I'm switched to Traxxas. And then it's a two channel servo with a waterproof servo. And it's uh, water, it's a 3500 kV motor. So, yeah, and then it's got a, this is where the battery mounts right there. So, I'm gonna quickly get my big batteries and see if they fit in there. If not, then that's gonna suck. So, these are the packs I wanna run. Versus, oh my gosh. Hope we'll see if it fits. I don't know, it's gonna be, it's gonna be tight. That's for sure, it's gonna get close. I don't know if I can run these. <sighs> That's disappointing, guys. Look at that. It won't fit. I'm gonna go do some finessing around and see if it fits. I'll be back. Well, sadly, these batteries do not fit, but maybe I might trim the foam to fit up there. But otherwise, this thing works great. Like, I didn't run it yet, but I just turned it on. And the reason I put Traxxas adapters on here is because, like, these were still new Dean's connectors, so they don't go on smooth. But I am gonna be snipping these and put Traxxas connectors on so I can run it with my hobby charger. Yeah, otherwise, this is just a quick unboxing of the Rage RC Black Marlin. I hope you did enjoy. Go ahead, like, subscribe, comment, follow me on Instagram at CarterLulofRC, and I'll see you next video.